got my wings to carry me. I don't know freedom. Get it. Yeah, I think we just need a. And you know, old should have just came in talking and then went from talking a few minutes into the show. Uh, got, <laughs> got ESPN on the side. You clip yours? He, he, he want to make sure everything we're saying is factual. That's good, that's good. Uh, there's a few things I said that was a little, I was like, mm. Yeah, um, there's a lot of things you say that got me like, <laughs> <laughs> Given Sunday podcast where we don't take any L's. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> podcast wise, we don't take yeah. L's. <laughs> I, t- I, so I, I got, I got two minutes. That's for the Hispanic folks, so they know we ain't let no other dudes in here. Oh, <laughs> 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 I'm telling you. <laughs> yeah, I'm, no joke. I'm, I'm telling you. Oh man, hell yeah, man. That's yeah, yeah, gotta, gotta be on your stuff with that one. That shit frustrated as fuck, boy. I hit some good hits too, and that would piss me off. At least, yeah. least I ain't get struck out, but one time, all my hits were just in the air too long. Yeah, I don't like that shit, man. That that was a, a completely winnable game too. That that was what frustrating about it. I like that. We can't get no consistent hits. Hits. They don't I could, I could make it a whole lot better. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, I've been. I've been playing for what two months now. Consistent, consistent, <laughs> yeah, consistently for two yeah, months. Yeah. Like I, I have my games here and there, but it, like that Rand, Randy Johnson card, like they got that, too much down shit in it, bro. Yeah, yeah, that, like, that, 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 so much shit yeah, in it and fucks me up because it's like but, right but, when I get bored with something, I'm like I can go do these challenges, and they're sitting there trying to hit home runs for an hour. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> like, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> But that, that what made me mad yesterday. They ended up dropping some new content and everything, and I was just like, man, like I li- like I literally just been playing nonstop, and I was like, man, like I'm I'm good for like the next like until they drop something else. Like there's so much like basically you gotta redo everything that you already did. I was like, man, that took so much time just to do that. So yeah, they they, they got a lot to do on there. You did all the Easter stuff, you know. I only yeah, found like I ain't getting nothing. Yeah, I only yeah, got, got all of it. <laughs> I got all of it. <laughs> you go crazy. Yeah, I've done, I've done literally <laughs> everything that you like for that first like little thing. Any card you can get, everything. Uh, well, I did everything. Yeah, yeah. So to see that end up dropping another thing and be like, yeah, now you got some more stuff to do. I was just like, bruh, like I literally just got done doing everything else. Yeah, you all that grimy. I just I. I the computer be getting my ass sometimes. I think yesterday after we play, I lost to the computer both off on home runs. Yeah, yeah, that'll make you mad. Since I know you grind more, I know you grind in both of them, MLB and Madden. Which one you think is easier to grind? Madden! <laughs> Madden. Yeah, Madden. Mm-hmm. Madden. But Madden is time, too. Like, you can play baseball and be playing for, like, two hours if, if like, you and the other person putting up 30 runs or something like that. Like with Madden, it's time. So like you, you know you're gonna be in there for like 20 minutes or so. Yeah. Even yeah. though I ended up taking the L on Madden yesterday, I was mad about that because I got stuck on my DB and ended up taking him away from a dude running a streak at the end of the game. It made me so mad. Oh, you did play. You did. How about Yeah, I, I was mad about that one. I ain't gonna. I lie. can't play Madden right now. It's the end of the season. I don't play no, Madden. I just, I just be playing. Uh, yeah, like on like on my head to head. Like just play with the 49ers. I know, I know you don't five. care about Madden because you don't want to play with the Broncos. What's that? I'm talking about the Warzone. Monday or Wednesday, but yeah. You, you like it? Yeah. You like it? Yeah. It's I'm, a I'm smaller map. Oh, okay. I'm, I might end up checking it out. Yeah, I might hop on there. I ain't shot nothing in a while. Oh, yeah, that's that what I was thinking about. Tight, man. It, it out there, man. Then you swear. <laughs> no, I don't need anybody at me. <laughs> 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 like, yeah, let, let me get on your noggin real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah. And, and see the way around the corner. No, yeah, that'll be lit. Like mid so. mid July or so, probably. Yeah, they yeah, still yeah. they still ain't re- uh, give a release date for it, which I'm I think glad. is wild. I'm glad they confirmed it. Like they paid, they paid. I guess whoever. Trip. Yeah, 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 yeah. It definitely happened. It definitely happened. And them folks 
was getting certain people like uh, Archie Man ain't gonna be in it because you know I they guess say he y'all want, can't pay me want enough. more money. Yeah, <laughs> you know he come from money, so <laughs> but they they they're, they're gonna be a pseudo uh, Archie in the game anyway. So like either you, either you can get recognized for your name, or they gonna just go put you in there and just change your name on there. So. Everybody else got names except him. They ain't gonna know who exactly who it is. I'm telling you, you folks gonna be out there just doing a creative player. And yeah, I got Archie. Yeah, I, I, miss, I miss them days. Well, you so good on Mitchell Ross. Like, oh, like like Madden yeah, yeah. 06 or something like that. Like, where where like you would actually like play like as the player. Like, that joke was so fun. Yeah, like, yeah, where they yeah. would like call plays for you and everything like that. And like now it's just you end up playing the game and you basically just play it like. I could create a running back. I could run the ball every single time if I wanted to, like yeah. calling plays and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I, I like the way that it used to be, and I don't, I don't understand how games ended up going from being so great back then to being like horrible I now. Because they had to get their money. They can get their money within time. And it might have been around for so long. Everybody knows they the only one got the license. And but what I'm, but shit. what I'm saying is like, like, like I said with that, with that create a player mode. Like how, how you did something one year and now years later where you got better technology and everything else but i know they ain't focused oh, on it because they don't make them no money but at least, at least give the folks that play offline like a reason to buy the game and stuff like that otherwise think, you're just doing a roster update every year so why not just yeah. sell sell madden and then just do a dlc for like rosters and stuff like that they, they, need, a, they yeah. need to bring head coach back too i used to play that back in 07 head coach 07 head coach but you just be a head coach. You need to play on the field. You just watch the game. Shoot, shoot. <laughs> yeah. cool. shoot bring, bring back blitz. <laughs> Who the developers of uh, NCAA? I thought you spoke about the EA. Oh, oh, you're talking about like, uh, like as far it's as like, it's it probably going to be Frostbite. I wouldn't be surprised if it was Frostbite. It's not, man. But I heard it's a new yeah. engine. I hope. They, I hope yeah, they hope I think, they I think really they was talking about, or I could have been reading an article how it should be. I don't know. So I'll be sitting in Madden all like, Look out in the stands when a playoff was or something. Like, you got layers playing like the same Yeah, thing. hell yeah. So, like, I know exactly what. Yeah. Like, 2K House. Well, it was back in 2K16 when they had like random uh, celebrities in the crowd. It's still like, like For real? Yeah, that's, that's right. Yeah, yeah, that was. <laughs> yeah, I ain't even know that. 2K16, like, 2K16, about the best 2K. 18. 18? With Paul Jordan on the cover. I think that was Paul Jordan. Yeah, that was my favorite. That's when I was uh, real good at the game. Whatever cover Paul George when I feel like it was 18. Yeah, we could look it up. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring your head coach back. I don't know why that ain't just a little game mode in. Goddamn mad. He can't. Uh, okay, then look at the cover. Yeah, 17, 17 there. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Paul George was somewhere around there. I see when they when they start doing that. I could be wrong with But yeah. These games could be better. I ain't even played two K this year. I so. played it a little bit. I, I like it. Uh, I mean, but it's it's basically like how it was back in the day. I don't I don't know if it's just because of the settings that I had that made it different or what, but like I was just playing it like I normally would play it. It was, it's a dead game. Oh, I mean, yeah, I, 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 well, I, after, after, well, I got I had it on Game Pass. And I know they said uh, in uh, August they taking it off of Game Pass. I was like, there ain't no point in me playing it then. Yeah. <laughs> Cause like oh, by, by the time yeah. it come off of Game Pass, I'm gonna just end up getting a new one. Yeah, so y'all, y'all basically just put a cap on what I want to do. Yeah, they yeah, yeah that they bullshit. Yeah, come out in two months, so I'll cover this. So. Yeah, exactly. There's no point, man. I, I, I don't think I'll be playing NBA 2K no more. Yeah. I, I ain't gonna lie, I'd be hating that I buy these games. That, well, except for MLB the Show, since it come out on Game Pass, I'd be hating that I buy that shit every fucking year, <laughs> every year. You know, last time I've been playing Madden though, like Madden. Oh, I was uh, NCAA worth it. I could go back to Madison last year, my first time either on it, on the Madden. You yeah, like that? I, I, I love Madden. I love Madden. I ain't, I ain't think I was gonna like it. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. like you, you, you decent at it, and like you don't really know what's going on. Like, once you get <laughs> like playing a whole lot more and stuff, like what one year in, like this is my like seventh season straight playing. Yeah, 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> since like 2017 at least. Yeah, I was playing 16 with Odell on the cover. Yeah, That's the yeah, first time I played hey, Ultimate I, I, Team. I would, I would say with Odell on the cover, but I, that when I found out when you were playing Ultimate Team, and basically ever since then, been playing Ultimate Team every single year. Look yeah, forward to it. Ultimate Team out there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Since 13, yeah. I think. Yeah. I know in uh, 25, the one with Richard Sherman. Or, and, I, and I know NCAA. Maybe with 15. With 14 I, I had it. I just know the one with Richard Sherman and the one with Adrian Peterson. Don't what they say online. I ain't. RG3 is on 14. That's RG3 on 14. Talking about NCAA? No. No, oh, the man. dude from Michigan was on 14. Yeah, the Norman Robinson. Okay, mm-hmm. okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh, RG3 was on 11. 11, I think, or 12. I had the one he was on because it was him and the Heisman below him. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing some good games. I ain't going to oh, yeah. lie. I love going yeah, from high school to playing like seven games of high school to going to picking your school and all that. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I need 500 yards rushing this game. <laughs> the, the, the coaching mode is pretty straight, too, on there, like being able to recruit your players and yeah. everything like that. Mm-hmm. Hopefully they put the INL shit deals in there. NIL. Whatever it is, and put that up in there. That was a totally different game. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. And, and that. You know, you used to, you used to have to, like, enroll in a certain class, and then, like, you know, like, <laughs> yeah. my studio has to actually take classes. <laughs> yeah, See, yeah, that, yeah. like, that, that that would be fine. They gave you, like, like some, like, little quiz questions and stuff like that. You had to keep your grades up on top of everything. I like that. that I feel like that would be pretty fine. Like, add, like, a trivia portion to it. Yeah, well, like, NCAA, uh, my player. But they they probably have to, they probably have to do like football facts and stuff like that. You don't want folks being out there. I'm stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, it was football shit. I don't think when I was playing, I don't remember them asking any math questions or oh, anything. If you if you choose a certain a certain uh, a course like certain uh, major, yeah, yeah, they gonna have some crazy questions. Yeah, that's that's wild. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't playing I'm, I'm this good game. with trivia, so I, I think I'll be straight doing all that. Uh, another fire aspect was you can play dynasty mode on college, and then transfer the the college the draft pick and well, the draft class over to Madden. I used to love doing that shit. Oh, I used to hate the nigga be 99 on college, and then the draft he'd be like a 69. <laughs> <laughs> like I ain't never gonna be able to build him up. He won highest man. He a third round pick. <laughs> I kind of did it. Well, they come on the play. Well, that when PlayStation Three came out. Uh, I know. I know. We. I did all for the GameCube, and all you had to do was uh save it to the memory card, and then transfer it over. And then transfer over to uh, the good old day with memory yeah, cards. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Never be like it again. Man. Now uh, the shit should just be built in the game. Yeah. So right when you get the other game, do you want to transfer this over? If it ain't like that, they are race whipping. That one, that one memory card, like a gigabyte worth of hundred, two hundred dollars. Like, you know, be like. We go to Goodwill and get a whole box full, twenty five cents. <laughs> Probably ain't even race. Get Randall shit in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that's a video right there. And I'm making ideas off the fly. Go, go, go. I want the whole box. Give you ten dollars for it. Yeah, no, <laughs> go yeah. there to go through all them. What I'ma find here? <laughs> That's probably how motherfucker people sex tapes get online. Yeah, Missing right. phones and stuff. Could okay, yeah. Over time. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, 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 y'all. Yeah. You went a whole different signal, right? Gaming <laughs> 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 That's how shit gonna go sometimes. But uh, y'all. Then uh, keep up with the beef and all that with Kendrick and all them. I, I oh, seen uh, J. Cole on a song on uh, Future New Out, though. We still don't trust you. Yeah, it's, it's, it's getting spicy enough now. Who, man. Kendrick on it? Uh, no, J. Cole, J. Cole on a song with Future and uh, on the We Still Don't Trust when You. When that came out? Yesterday, yesterday yeah. Uh, I don't know what's going on now. A song like, called Red he, Leather. He, he wasn't. He wasn't but Future like he, 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 was, he was he was Drake though. Yeah, yeah, so. he, he he wasn't like dissing Drake or nothing on there. Who J Cole? Yeah, 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 yeah. He wasn't dissing he Drake or nothing. Just, but uh, it's your it's your weird that like Future going at Drake. Basically, J Cole was on the side with Drake. Kendrick dissed both of them uh, supposedly, and now J Cole did a song with uh Future. But like he he must have had done good. that song. I, I, I thought it was decent. That was a better than seven minute drill. Seven uh, to seven, you don't even hit the same missing. You'll probably die. So I don't even, I 
I can't even put it in rotation anymore. <laughs> It was it was hard. Yeah, hard, but it, it hit But then I went back and listened to Kendrick's shit, and his shit was hard too. Yeah, yeah Kendrick made did. the song kind of. Yeah, 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 he did. I'm trying to when Joe Buddy talking about some. I don't know he's speaking in, in riddles or what. And it went into the book. And it came out. Right, so I don't know what I don't know what both that mean, but I guess he's saying Drake. He said nothing else needs to be said. Drake came in the booth and came out and Kenny did the same. But Kenny took the first shot, so I'm like, but Jake was wrong. Drake was wrong. So, so they were responding on IG. IG was, IG was pitching and posting. I, I ain't gonna lie. It's watch watching grown men go back and forth, basically over just over a girl. Thirty years. Like all this started over a girl, yeah. and like I just felt like that stupid childish. Yep. Yeah. Like uh, who? Uh, you, you uh, Drake and them? Huh? Drake and them? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that, I'm that, about that. to say Kendra yeah. and J. Cole go deeper. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I mean, but it's it, 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 crazy that, like, how all this ended up coming to the forefront and everything like that. Mm-hmm. You know, Drake, Drake, man, he, he dude ain't got no respect for nobody, man. He, you know, he, he'll try your girl, man. That's what happened with Wayne. Wayne, Wayne, well, look. Try, um, uh, so now. Smash one of the girl, man. Ooh, who, who he smashed? Smash one of the Wayne girls. He put in one of his old uh, memoir. And I was like, this crazy. Yeah, same thing with ASAP Rocket, but he's made. I mean, he did. I'm pretty sure he's made. They kind of hit. They had him first, though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> no, I'm saying so. ASAP doing the Drake. That's all that is. What's that? Drake. Drake. I mean, ASAP Drake. Man, Drake ain't. I don't. This all stupid. These niggas millionaires over yeah, here. Exactly. exactly. Damn bitch. Can't, can't, can't have any girl they want in America. They fighting over one girl because Drake ended up smashing the girl. In the man. world. Like, that, that, you know. just, that just wild, bro. Like, just wild somebody, to me. I just say, you, you got to get on somebody else. They going after your girl and they know you together. It's a whole different thing, then. I mean, yeah, but but at the same time, like, why why not drop a diss track for the girl for her? Like, yeah, he, yeah, like for not being loyal. Yeah, like, if, if anything, that's true, that's like, true. Know, yeah. it's gonna make that. You can't be just mad at dude, even though you know him, but she's supposed to hold you down too. Though. Exactly. We, so who's in the right? Dana, who's in the wrong? Dana has, Dana has taken them. They open their legs. Two women of persistence. So who's in the right? Who's in the wrong? Both the women and drug wrong. I I feel I feel like out of all of it is just Drake just because like I think Future ended up finding out about her or whatever because he put put it in a song or something like that talking about like he had smashed a girl just because Future ended up smashing. Oh, yeah. But like you, you ain't got to say that like all all the songs you got all the lines you got and everything you got what folks that would probably write for you and stuff like that like that one line that you didn't need to put into a song and like none of that would end up happening so. It's on my colleague. That's what Travis got into. It's on my uh, Bella Hadid uh, 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 weekend day. That's why he got into it. I'm like, man. That man, I think, I think he got basically as many like number one Billboard records as uh Michael Jackson. Like, think about that. As, as many as Michael Jack Drake. We all remember when Drake ended up coming out. Never would have expected something like that from him. So like he he could retire today and be straight like I don't I don't understand the point he of him putting, putting that line huh I said he bigger than Michael Jackson Ex- exactly yeah at this point and that's crazy because I don't see him dancing ago. like him <laughs> Michael Jackson around this area oh yeah yeah if Michael Jackson was in this area that that man would take off R I P looking out I mean then we wouldn't have artists like the weekend and then they can't. All, all be around at the same time. Yeah. They were influenced by Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chris Brown. Well, Chris Brown was around with. Uh, Michael was still doing a little thing. Yeah, I remember he was crying to me too when he passed. Tell me everything I know. Why <laughs> MTV was Michael Jackson for a whole month, boy. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. There was nothing oh, yeah, else. Yeah, 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 definitely. That was some wild shit. I'm telling you. Somebody else died like that, and they only did it for, like, somebody else died. But I remember it was just only a short period of time when they were playing their shit. But, I mean, Michael Jackson grew, Michael Jackson grew up in the business, though. Like, from being being part of Jackson 5 and everything, and like, they, they could play his songs for a whole month because he had just a, a huge catalog of songs. Mm-hmm. Yeah, was he the first kid? The kid celebrity like that? I don't, I don't think know. he was the first. I said probably besides uh, kid celebrity. 
before as, far, as far as like singing, yeah, probably. I was gonna say, oh, the girl was like animal crackers in my soup. <laughs> oh, I was just talking about Duh, period, uh, but then I was like, Andy, on <laughs> yeah, Andy. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause I guess them bitches like the bit from uh, Wizard of Oz. I'm assuming she was like a little kid. I wouldn't say little kid, but younger. Yeah, and that probably before Michael Jackson. I'm pretty sure it is. Michael Jackson ended up making a remake to the movie, so. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be interesting. I feel like these days there's so many kids, celebrities, like, fuck it, how long has Jake Paul been in front of us now? Yeah. Like, oh, crazy. Yeah, uh, you, I mean, you can take off Disney. for real as a kid, just get you a YouTube channel and stuff yeah, like he that. Was on the Disney channel. And he, was also, like a, he was in the show? Yeah, he was on the show on Disney channel. Both of them? No, not Logan. Logan was just popular off of fine. I never knew that, man. I never knew Yeah, it was called Bizarre or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how he got, and that's why it was such a big old deal when he started doing random wild stuff. Cause it was like, this Disney fired the man. I remember when he was blowing up on YouTube and Disney got rid of him. He was still on the show. So. That's crazy. And once you, man, once you make it, make it, make a name for yourself, you might as well. Man, yeah, he took it to another level, man. Don't forget, he about to fight Mike Tyson. Not everybody about to get to do that one and get a payday yeah, out but, of but it. But my whole thing, like, him, him boxing all them folks, like, there, there's no, like, no way of winning those. Like, I know they got, like, the fight, like, the whole bunch of stipulations with the fight and stuff like that. Like, you ain't really boxing. I know what you call Tommy Fury, boy. You know some vicious <laughs> Yeah, that probably his most, like, real, real, like, equal fighter. Everybody else been, like, Older than him, yeah. past their prime. I was surprised. He got yeah, a chin, exactly. Though. I ain't gonna lie. Like, he got a chin. I was surprised. Like, he, 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 he. Oh, but they, it, it seems like when people start fighting or slap boxing, they grow a beard. <laughs> they like, I need soul cushion. <laughs> they say, well, back in the day, like, oh, uh, Vikings and stuff, they kept it. What the Vikings did? Slap each other? No, they like, fight. Like, they like soften your blow. You got a beard. Oh, no, okay. that's like, soften your blow. Yeah, no more. I, I doubt they just straight up fought each other. They probably had access and shit in there. <laughs> there was no rules back there. You didn't like somehow you could just burn it on going about the day the <laughs> next day. <laughs> no investigation. <laughs> None at all. And if somebody do investigate it, burn it down. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking to about, uh, like, back in the day, like, you know how it is now, like, how girls shoot and, like, Choose relationships like people in relationships. Like back in the day, caveman just had a club. Yeah, they had a club. 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 They Closest being an animal as possible, man. <laughs> so I know it was crazy. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, that's survival of the fittest, bro. You might I'm get all you girls. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> they weren't even talking back there. They were. Conk. 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 Back, back, back to sports. <laughs> Bad baseball going on. We got golf going on. Got NASCAR UFC yeah. 300 today. Yeah, how that car looking? I ain't even looked at the car. Look at the like, car. It, it, it's not a great car. Like for for UFC 300. Like 200. For, yeah, for I mean for for the noise that they be making about it. Everything they had Sean O'Malley fight for in UFC uh 299. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, why? Like, why wouldn't you just yeah. like have all the champions fight for UFC 300? Yeah, that's like. Amazing. But also, they, I mean, also a good point to start, a, a good time to build your star, too. Yeah, yeah. You don't want, you don't want to just put all your stars in one show and not build up another one. Yeah, I mean, I, like, I completely understand that. Like, I, I know they wanted to get some eyes on uh, UFC 299, and that's why they probably put O'Malley in there. Yeah. But, like, as far as, like, the they fights for today, like, I'm, 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 I'm excited for Oliveira to uh, fight. I'd like to see what Alex Perea do, does. Yeah. Uh, Justin Gagey and uh, 
Max Holloway should be a good fight, but outside of that, it's it's just it seems like it's a whole bunch of nobodies that they're just trying to build up. And I'm just like, for UFC 300, like y'all y'all talk about the the hundred ones, man. like they a Super Bowl and stuff like that. So everybody it's just, trying it's just to move up weight class. Man, UFC is fucked right now. I ain't saying like they have good have fights. UFC like a month ago. I went talking through. about like two ninety nine. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Was, oh, Miley, no. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. They drop one every they month. Had many, oh. Yeah, yeah. They they had quite a bit of uh pay per views. Yeah, I always felt like, like they did wrestling type shit. Like yeah. at least once every two months yeah, type shit. Like, versus at three hundred now. Like, when yeah. did UFC start at early two thousand ten? Like when did they did But two hundred was a few years ago. Cause that's Brock Lesnar like, that's when Brock Lesnar and Hunt fought, wasn't it? I'm saying like when did UFC start? I know like late late two thousand ten. No, USC started in the 90s, 92. Yeah, I think I think it was like early 2000s, probably. But when they, yeah, when they started going to rules in the 90s, they didn't have rules. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, would yeah, grab a nigga in the dick and all that oh, shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's wild. Yeah, like, Gab the nigga eyeballs out. Like, they approved it. You know, they crazy. Like, they finally approved something like this for TV. And they took everything like mm-hmm. strong, but I'm trying to see like when they make the UFC one. That, you- always, like. You, you, USC, the craziest sport I ever seen. Bro. USC one was like, in the nineties. They still count them first ones as USCs. Okay, okay. Yeah, they they were still they were just on uh, Dana didn't own it. The other dude owned it. The brothers, or I think it was brothers. I don't want to say it was, but Dana didn't own it till early. When you start seeing Joe Rogan, I think like. Joe Rogan around before Dana was around. You, you, you confused me. There were last episode. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm telling you. Why you talking about Joe Rogan? You confused people like me. Well, that's just because Joe you, you Rogan. You said, brothers, like, Joe Rogan and Dana White owned it? Because I was about to say, they, whenever you start seeing Joe Rogan around, that's when Dana owned it. But Joe Rogan knew the owners prior to it. He just was a fan of fighting because he was a fighter himself. Okay. I didn't know that Joe Rogan was a fighter. Yeah, just did shoot. He was competition, but it never was no USC competition. He was like competition yeah. overseas and yeah, shit. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, any, anybody, anybody you know who got cauliflower ears, you shouldn't even hear oh. that. <laughs> you ever see Dustin Poirier's ears? Boy, that, 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 man, that man ears through. That first thing I'm checking out, I'm sorry, somebody. Let me see how it's <laughs> Bitches, too. <laughs> what ears? Yeah, no, I'm just saying the bitches got it too. Oh yeah, I want you to be fucking with them. Yeah, that's it. Bitch got that. I like. Oh yeah, she like, not like, I, off like I said. You, UFC is a crazy sport. It's a crazy sport. That's, that's, a, that's one of the only sports where you walk into a cage and you can end up losing your life by the end of your match. Yeah, and, yeah. And every single match like takes takes another match off of your career, basically, or shortens your career. Like Dana says, up and down business. Just because it's so hard to build stars. Because right when you think you got a star, like Ronda. Yeah, Lose two in a row, like right, right. shit like she's that. On the, she's on the street. I think she was like, yeah, she went on the street for real. I think she was like won like five and That's won all. the belt and then lost. But it like like I said, like the, the more fights you end up taking, like the worse your body gonna end up being. So that that's why it's so hard to keep like a champion for so long. Like no. I know a lot of people. Uh, Is John John the greatest? Is that Ron Jones? Uh huh. You give it. Uh, I, I I don't like the way he got. I, it, it, does he still fight? I don't think Anderson Silva does. Yeah, John John Jones is hell though. He's yeah, John hell. Jones hell. If, if, it, if it wasn't for all the suspensions and everything, he probably would have been one of the greatest DC, of all time. DC could be up there too. He was hell. Who that? Uh, uh, Damian Cormier. Oh, Daniel Cormier. Yeah. Uh, who who who's the uh, Russian dude? I always forget Khabib. his name. Yeah, Khabib. Oh yeah, I, yeah, like, yeah, like yeah, that, yeah. That dude with hell too. Yeah. Uh, can't forget Frank Shamrock. Griffin. Griffin. My 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 one of my favorites right now is Ty Tuvasa. Even though he he ain't he ain't great, but I like that he drinks beer out of a shoe when he wins. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, yeah, you you a crazy dude to be doing some stuff like that. Uh, <laughs> but I'm telling you, I can barely drink beer out of a can. <laughs> yeah, hell no. Like, Give it to me on tap. <laughs> but if any time I could do it is after I beat a nigga ass. <laughs> Give it to me. I'm an animal. <laughs> I can do anything right now. Even drink beer from a shoe. Let's just knock somebody out. I tell you. I drink, the, I drink the beer out of the shoe and then lick the bottom of the shoe. I like it. Like it. <laughs> Yeah, but that's like uh, 
chase her with a limb. And <laughs> <laughs> wow. I taste shit. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man, we. Wow, I ain't never heard nothing like this. <laughs> yeah, I, I seen niggas doing on YouTube, but you expect niggas on YouTube to do anything? You so. know, I was just pouring my glove. Then they came like, <laughs> like, like, like a shoe, but you too. Uh, that still's a motherfucker. Well, they they got they got the masters going on right now too. Tiger Shit. in it. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. He made he made his twenty fourth straight cut. Most all time at Augusta. Yeah. All we got to mention black excellence. Won, like two thousand eighteen. I mean, he he probably end up falling back oh, after after that. today. Huh? You won, you won yeah, like yeah, yeah. I think twenty nineteen. Nah, yeah, yeah. Mistaken. He only won one since two thousand. But I mean, since oh eight. Yeah, but I mean, for him to even like be in it or anything like that, like everything that he been through as far as injuries and stuff, like that, how you know that man was great in his prime. Yeah, yeah, he good, but maybe feel better than him. You think feel better than him? Feel had a hell of a career though. Oh, yeah, I mean, he did, he did. Uh, yeah. But he got to the late seventies or something, early seventies. Who? Phil. Phil ain't that old. I ain't, that old. I ain't gonna lie. If I can go yeah, back and do it all, like, it's five years older. I'd love to be a golfer. No way, look it up. Look up Tiger Age first. But yeah, yeah, I, th- I think. Uh, yeah, I think he's old, in his fifties. Well, Tiger's in his fifties, ain't he? No, I'm saying man, gotta be like seventy. He swear seventy. Oh, he's fifty-three. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Old. Like him he and Tiger, old, he was. Man. He probably came in like two years before Tiger. If not the same year, I want to say the same year, but I'm just giving him some few more years. But yeah, you got you got Scotty Scheffler out there doing his thing, and Bryson DeChambeau, Max Homer did pretty well this weekend Scottie so far. Great, so that's what I'm saying. I said five years at the max. Oh, no, I'm just saying I didn't know he was that young, bro. Yeah, you can play golf for a long time though. Hell yeah, he got another twenty years. I'm- <laughs> 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 you 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 could just be average doing playing another twenty saying, years, man. be straight. You end up winning just one major, you fine. You know what I'm saying where he at? Twenty shambo. Yeah, the shambo Scheffler and Homer. Twenty second. Yeah, he's, yeah, 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 yeah. He he he's one over right now. He ain't he ain't gonna be able to win because he got a long way to go. He's Anything can happen. Back, but they they drop seven strokes back. You ain't gaining seven strokes over over the next two days. They, they drop golf on if he, on if game he did, pass. he he would definitely go down as greatest of all time. <laughs> I mean, he already and, and if he do it, I'd be mad that I didn't get money on him. <laughs> Only niggas I see greater are with the people that started the golf shit. I know their equipment was like shit. Jack Nicklaus. <laughs> I know their golf shit was like, what the fuck we doing out here? Tell you. <laughs> they got down pulling they, they hit a the rock with a stick. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it was. Oh yeah, yeah. Hopefully Tiger does well. I'm I'm hoping he cracked top fifteen. We we got we got baseball going on too today, of course. Baseball just about every day. Y'all know who leading the league as far as best records go. Who got the best record right now? Yeah. Ain't Yankees only lost a few games? Yeah, Yankees ten and three. <clears throat> shout out to the team. Oh, oh, shout man. shout out to Jonathan Loisaga. We lost him for the season. I liked him as as a pitcher. Hope he heals up quickly. Tommy John? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I think so. I think so. No, no, no. I think it was UCL. If I'm not right, mistaken. Right. They throwing them balls hard these days, man. Yeah. They saying, oh, they saying, it's like, by middle school, pitchers be basically tore their down. Yeah. It was a call because yeah. they throwing it, middle school throwing it like MLB, like it was the 80s. Yeah. Y'all get it to man. Go on body, man. Oh yeah, that game going hella fast. Also, also, also got to shout out Steven Strasburg. Had a great career, man. Ha- ha- happy retirement, my boy. I remember watching him come into the league. He was well, Puerto Rican. You said a New York Yankee. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know nothing about him, but it's too I early to be saying Yankers. anything. <laughs> How many games they play so far? Yankees thirteen. They, they ten and three. Exactly. They, well, I mean, they they playing another one today. They got a hundred more to go. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but I mean, that that's why I can't get too excited about it. Cause I definitely seen us like take off like at the beginning of the season, and then injuries just catch up to us by the end of the but season. They got but, so many fucking games. <laughs> yeah. The Braves. The Braves. You a Braves fan? Yeah. Name three players from the Braves. Recent. 
Now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's on the team now. Hell no. Nah, I don't know. Yeah. Got it. Chipper Maybe, Jones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, just, you could just be like, you, you could just be a Matt Olsen, Acuna, Albies. You could have got Acuna yeah. and Albies easily. Uh, I don't no, no, is it Zuna still? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's Zuna still. Nah, I ain't going to. Austin Rhymes. I ain't going to leave the fewer strong. I don't, mm. he, he really a Philly fan. He loved Bryce Harper. <laughs> Back in the day, I was. You know what take you if you were a real Braves fan, man? Huh? If you're a real Braves fan, we're, we're taking in, man. Nah. Yeah, no, we're Braves. The Bra- Bra- Braves, Bra- Braves are good, man. The Braves are good. Nah, Anything nah. Oh, it would be fine. That, that's if the I one Georgia team game. other than UGA that I will root for. Right. Yeah, is the Braves. Yeah, like I, I'm not like a like a huge Braves fan, but like I do I do like the Braves. I do root for. Them. I, I can root for the Hawks. Well. I, I, I can't root for the Hawks. I just need Kirk Cousins, man. Please. <laughs> that, that, that's, that, that's what the commanders and the Vikings said too. I got to. Yeah, I don't, uh, y'all curse. Yeah, y'all probably about to. I can't deny it though, man. I can't deny it. To, in football, I said. Yeah, 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 yeah. At one point, I would say uh, college too, but. Y'all, y'all end up stepping up. We, we gonna, we gonna turn this too, man. Fuck the pussy dogs. Can't wait to see, can't wait to see Brown. Swear. I'm telling you, we, we ready to go to Tuscaloosa. With it. Get them, get them dogs. Sick them, sick them. <laughs> what, what, it, what it is? Yeah, man, y'all got some competition this year. Um, Auburn. You know, like y'all beefing. Y'all, y'all, y'all just, y'all just gotta tell I've been, I've been trying to keep up with them, but there ain't nothing going on. They've been doing more like um, uh, coaching staff shit right now. They ain't really did nothing. I ain't hearing about no players. I mean, I hear about players, but these players also I'm looking at it, and then they got Alabama, Georgia. Yeah. They're like, they probably going to one of them schools probably. <laughs> yeah, boy, 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 boy. <laughs> Auburn in a horrible place as far as recruiting goes. I mean, I, don't, I think they ain't nothing like in between Georgia, Alabama. They like right in between. Like, but so I mean, like, like the sweet spot, yeah. But I mean, as far as like where you're recruiting players, like if if it's a good play, like if you want good players, they got the choice of going to mm-hmm. Alabama, Tennessee, uh, yeah. Georgia, Florida. Like I mean, that, that's just that's your I'm telling you, that's the only way they can get folks up there. Like you don't want to sit for three years. Like come on over to Auburn. We'll start you from your freshman season. We ain't gonna win a whole lot of games, but we'll start you. Man, that, it don't be take oh, oh, yeah. Imagine if he was set by Mark Ingram. But, I mean. But he came yeah. and talked to the right Mm hmm. I think so. Who low went by Trent Richardson? TJ Yeldon? Uh, I man, think. Uh, yeah, yeah, Bo Scarborough? Yeah, I, like, mm-hmm. I don't know what Bo Scarborough is. I'm telling they you. Do. There have been so many running backs come out of Alabama that ain't do well. He got locked up. This is what I said. You Mac trucking over here now? Mac trucking. No, I don't even know who the dude is. Honestly, he must not been that great. Most of them. Well, he was, he was good for like a year, but he, I think he had ankle problems. Ankle problems. That's how it usually goes. But yeah, like, what if if y'all went to college? Would you try to go like start for four years? And try to try to uh, break records and stuff, or would you prefer to sit like three years, stay healthy, and go to the league? I, I sit for three years just so I can get all of the free. Seem like that's the thing too. If you end up sitting on the bench and stuff, like you end up getting your degree, you don't got to really worry about going to a whole bunch of classes and stuff. You can just focus on football. Mm-hmm. Nah, I feel like that's that's the best way to go. Man, take take them first two I, seasons. I guess. I guess. It doesn't matter what you're going for. You yeah. get a degree and I do shit with it. I'd rather go and try to go and get my money in the NFL real quick. But I mean, dude, you just because you play all four years, don't mean that you. I mean, you could. Oh no, I ain't talking ACL about playing. I ain't, I ain't talking about playing four years. But I sit and wouldn't give a fuck about school. <laughs> if a motherfucker treat me wrong, getting in a transfer portal, oh, go yeah, somewhere yeah. else. Can, yeah, like now, now is the time. Athlete can be who they want to oh, be. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Speak, also... speak, speaking of trash report, I saw earlier in the week uh, Louisville hired a new head coach. Literally all of their scholarship players entered a transfer portal. 
how did every yeah. how did every single one of your transfer or your scholarship That's players into the transfer portal? And now they're trying to make it some type of way, like you can transfer and immediately play. Yeah, this yeah. I mean, man. yeah. I don't like, think that really it, it's been that way for like the last couple of years. I, I believe. think pretty much since COVID. Yeah, yeah. But uh, but I think I think that's what ruined. Like they they should at least have to miss like three games or something like that. Like they have to be game? some kind of penalty yeah, I for. Like I said, at least take it out of eligibility. If anything, I'd be like, if you transfer, you you can't get in the draft. You ain't getting the draft until you sit the whole year somewhere. Oh yeah, okay, okay, okay. I, I wouldn't that. not let them play because. Highlight tape is very valuable. Yeah, I mean, I like I, I understand like it. It's gonna be different from player to player because some folks might like somebody might have to transfer back home to take care of their mom or something like yeah. that. Like I wouldn't want to penalize them for for doing something for their family, but like for the folks that are just like all the Alabama players that ended up transferring after Nick Saban ended up retiring. Like no, you you committed to the University of Alabama, play for the University of Alabama, like uh like Bond, like. He, that Texas was just willing to give him, uh, yeah, a whole bunch of money, like cars that. and shit. I love that. I, I love that motherfuckers can do all this shit. I don't see it as it's a bad thing. I mean, I think it's going to definitely water down dynasties for sure. But, oh, yeah, definitely. But other speak, than that, like, speak, it's speaking. college football. These motherfuckers for years wasn't getting nothing. And motherfuckers getting injured. Now it's because... These players can't abuse this shit now. Let them abuse it. They've been getting abused. Them yeah, motherfuckers, true. they ain't even playing, didn't get a dime for this shit. Probably I mean, in a wheelchair now. now what, what's so that? Like, it's just different. I mean, if you pay people who were getting abused back then, I would say, okay. Man, what's that? Yeah. Running back from Oklahoma back in the day, he ended up, man, fuck. And they made a whole E60 about him and everything. He a truck driver now. He went to the pros and everything. He wasn't the best pro, but he ended up getting injured too. But he did hella in Oklahoma. Adrian Peterson. Oh. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> it was probably twenty years before. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I know, I know. Like, man, like all them, just say for all them people, young people getting that type of money, man. They're not about listening to their coach. Just say for instance, Isaiah Bond. Just say he got one point five or seven hundred thousand. I don't know what he got. Yeah, 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 yeah. He go to Texas. One he wild receiver coach getting it, getting his ass about something he did. It makes you be like, man, like. Who did man talk to me? I would make way more money. You know? And and I look I at you, like, I look at you like this, motherfucker. You ain't going to the pros then. <laughs> like it's just yeah, that simple. Yeah, like like you, you, like you, okay. Now if your talent undeniable, we can't say shit. Your talent yeah, just undeniable. Yeah. But if it, not everybody talent undeniable. I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm talking about people getting paid this type of money, so they tell they gonna be undeniable. So nah, I'm no, 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 no. You could get that money just because you need they, they they need your ass. Yeah. I mean, they were, I mean, they're talking about Isaiah Bond. Like, he, he wasn't a good of a player. Ex- exactly, and they yeah. gave you money just to need you. And now, if you don't yeah, want to listen got, to the coach and go keep on needed. making this money, that's on you. Be an asshole. I'm like, I ain't, I won't, as a coach, I would let, let him fall off. <laughs> like, I mean, wouldn't send him like. He can have a Caribbean asshole, man. <laughs> like, he got, he got four years to bounce around. Like, he probably. Oh, yeah, I mean, but I'm, I'm pretty sure NFL scouts are looking at all that shit, too. Like, they. Gotta put accountability in that shit too. If I'm done went to did four years and went to three schools, that ain't looking too good. I wanna yeah. be drafting a motherfucker knowing right when his rookie deal come up, we he gonna be trying to get a crazy amount of money or he gone. Like, yeah, nah. I mean they, I can't see what they do now. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. But a lot of motherfuckers hit get extension before their rookie deals up. If you if you're good enough. Yeah. So since, since since you mentioned the dynasty land, since South Carolina the girls ended up uh, winning the championship undefeated on Monday, y'all think having dynasties in sports makes it more enjoyable to watch, or would you rather see like dynasties not be? be no, no, formed? dynasties definitely make it enjoyable. Yeah. Well, what well, what do you think makes it more enjoyable? Like trying like watching them win, or just somebody got to be, see them lose. Somebody got to be at the top. It's a little of both. I like to see, like, sometimes I like to see an underdog, like, how, well, I can say the women, when the women, I want the girls play South Carolina, I wouldn't consider, I would, them considering I would under, an underdog just because they had Caitlin, mm-hmm. but Caitlin Clark, but they were kind of an underdog, so like, I, would, yeah. I would like them to see beat. Yeah, I mean, South Carolina only lost three games over, like, the last three yeah. seasons, so, yeah, Iowa was definitely an underdog. Hell, yeah. 
But I know there there's some folks that'll say like, ah oh, man, I don't want to watch that sport because like Alabama wins all the time. UConn back in the day wins that's all what the makes time. It so good. At one, like, at one yeah. point, I was like, they were Alabama and Nick Saban, but man, like, well, I'm sorry, but Nick Saban gone. What? <laughs> 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 but I was like, I, was I echo those like, sentiments. <laughs> yeah, I want to give up on uh, college football, but like, every yeah. smart came out like, okay, okay. It's, that, uh, exactly, and that's what makes it good. Yeah. Like somebody got to step up to beat yeah. this boss. Like yeah. that's why was, the Patriot shit was so good. And that's why Eli Man a Hall of Famer regardless, because yeah. everybody knew Tom Brady was the greatest at that point, and like, he got two of them from it, him. It's it crazy that man could have nine rings if it wasn't for Eli Man. <laughs> that's, <what I'm> <laughs> that's wild. Easily bro. the goat. So. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Dynasty. I love when the Warriors were doing their thing. And, yeah. I hate to see y'all. You ain't lying, because I hate to see it kind of come down to the end. Like, mm-hmm. It's it slowly coming to the end. Like, yeah, you, you don't really got a Dynasty in, in basketball right now. Hell with the, no. Like, with the Warriors not being there no more. LeBron. Some guy, they uh, traded uh, Bruce Brown for uh, this guy named Peyton, Wa- Peyton Watson. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah you're talking about... uh. The, uh, nuggets. The nugget, yeah, like nuggets, nuggets. You think you think the Nuggets could be a dynasty? They could be, man. I don't think they could be a dynasty like like Golden State. Like yeah. you know they're gonna be there. Like you know they're gonna make it to the conference or the championship every year. But with, with the way that the Thunder looking, I think they could be the next dynasty because I, I think they still got a whole bunch of draft picks and they they way oh, ahead ahead of where they wanted to be. What, what, they can get Bronny and get LeBron over there all season and send them out of the vein, Really, like I'm telling you. What's the definition of a dynasty? Because you can win three in a row, or I, you can go I, separate years and win in one, but with the same group. I'd, I'd say like three in five years. Yeah. You win, you win three championships in five yeah. years. Like but you, the you, same team, but different players could still be a dynasty? Yeah, yeah. And that I same say, shit? I say different players. You know, Nick Saban's on a dynasty. Yeah. Like, Nick Saban's yeah. on a dynasty easily 10 or 15 years. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, it, it, it could be either the players or the coach. Mm-hmm. Hey, uh, yeah. Michael Jones, he had the dynasty with the Bulls. Steve Kerr. Bill Jackson. Yeah. Greg Popovich, he was in the dynasty. Yeah. He was a big reason of Greg the dynasty. Popovich, he might be another dynasty if he, if he keep at it. I think they gave him an extension for five years. Though. Which is crazy. Popovich Seemed like he going to die doing that. I think Popovich all he know about. <laughs> I mean, yeah, wife gone. Really? I'm pretty sure. I oh, remember yeah, it was yeah. a sad I, I, deal. I wouldn't stop either, bro. I wouldn't stop, bro. As soon as he stopped, man, like, he about to go down here. Yeah, um, man, the the end of the basketball season is tomorrow. Everybody playing their last game. That's what what the Lakers at? Lakers, I think they Look where the Lakers at, man. I think they they're the mean? ninth seed right now. Ninth? I know they ain't from the, I know they ain't from the old Warriors. Either the ninth or the eighth. They're in front of the Warriors, but I think the Kings are in front of them. I know I know that the Suns are the seventh seed. Uh, hopefully they don't get in, so my prediction get right. Standings. They're looking like Yeah, they're the eighth seed right now. What? Yeah. <laughs> so so basically all they can they, they and then they gonna play the Suns. Like if they if they win their next game and they play the Suns, I think they beat the Suns and get that seventh seed. Which would be crazy if they, they they probably end up facing Minnesota in the first round. Who you got, Minnesota or the Lakers? Hold on, oh Minnesota. Really? You think? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Mm. Because it, nah, I got, I got Minnesota. I got Minnesota. Mm. I, I, I was thinking about who was all Minnesota. That's that's a bold statement for a team that ain't never been there before. Oh, you got right now, like, Andre. It's injured. definitely gonna be hard on AD, but it'll be a good warm up for it to be able to go up against the Nuggets, Gobert, having to go up against go Gobert and uh, Towns. Yeah, no Nuggets gonna be hell. I got a Nugget running back, but with them Tim Wolf and Laker Matter, I feel like Gobert gonna neutralize him. I think Mavericks can surprise folks. Yeah, they playing hell. Oh, it look, oh that wild! It look like they gonna end up playing the Clippers. <laughs> you know they got the Clippers number. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So Luka 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 Luka. Uh, play in is on the fifteenth. So what's today? The thirteenth. Monday. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. Oh, no, it's either the fifteenth or the sixteenth. I can't remember which one. But yeah, it's, it's it's literally this week. Playoffs gonna start. I wouldn't mind because I know I know the Lakers are gonna get 
put up just to get let down. The bottom of the East is so weak. I feel, I feel like the Lakers can make like the the way that they I mean they won the play the the play the season play in tournament so like if they can win that I know they're gonna win the play in play in uh game. The East is get, so weak, huh? The bottom of the East is so weak. They're I'm gonna, telling you, <laughs> they gonna get mad. I can't wait. I know regardless they make it up, they're gonna lose to the Lakers. Like the Heat ain't even that good in my eyes. Seventy no, sixers ain't even that good in my eyes. Well, they get Embiid, oh yeah, Embiid, yeah, and like. Embiid back, but he hurt his knee again yesterday. Yeah. Well, yeah, oh, he, it like it like man. buckled on him. They said there wasn't any damage or anything, but Pacers to, are above average. To I got, still, I got the Bucks coming out of there for him to like come back when when he came back and try to like play playoff basketball like that's gonna be tough for the 76ers like and it's it's sad because they, they're they definitely a number three seed if mb doesn't get hurt i'm yeah, they crazy like the only thing is like you gotta be healthy around this time yeah yeah, yeah. Like, and b it'd it be totally don't different miss shots but you you see you see how many games uh the boston celtics have on the number two seed right they over, over them by 14 14 games. points or 14 games bro like that that's ridiculous I, that, I, that's why i don't think anybody in the Gonna touch the Celtics, but you know the Celtics. The Celtics, they are like that every year, like they play that every year. Yeah, like, but I mean, what 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 team gonna end up beating? I mean, the, what Miami beat them last year? I think. I didn't make the championship, but they lost to the uh, Knicks. Nah, the Heat went to the championship last year. Heat was the championship. Mhm. Come on, the, man! The, the, You're supposed to know this. Heat, the Heat be coming out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, no, that. See, that's look, my... I remember because they, they they were forcing Jalen Brown to his left, and he kept turning the ball. Over. I thought it was in the championship. Nah, I, th- I think uh, if I remember right, Boston beat Milwaukee, and I think Milwaukee was the number one seed. And then, but I can the see Heat the Heat beat. beating Boston. You think the Heat could beat Boston? Mm-hmm. I can see that. I could. See, it, he always be doing the, surprises. Uh, yeah, shit. yeah, yeah. They do. And then they definitely ain't as good as their record is because exactly. they, they definitely had a lot of injuries throughout the season. But still, like, I don't feel like they match up too well against the Celtics. I don't think anybody can match up other than uh, the Nuggets. Well, man, mm-hmm. ain't that far. But, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think they – I say they ain't getting out the second round. I don't know who they playing, but I just can't huh? – Nah, I give them. Nah, I give them. Nah, I give them all the way to the Eastern yeah. Conference Finals. Who's that? Celtics, and then whoever they play in that. In the Eastern Conference lose. Finals. Mm-hmm. Let's see who who would they play in the Eastern Conference Finals. Celtics. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to see right now. You you think the Bucks make it that far? Like they they yeah, just that'd be they a good play one though. On the road. That'd be a good one though. Oh, if, if, if the Knicks had Julius Randle, I would give it to them. But I, w- I wouldn't be surprised if the Pacers go all the way. Yeah, I, w- I would pick the Pacers. I got the Pacers and the Celtics playing in the championship. I don't, like, I don't championship. like how they play that shit. I don't, yeah. I don't like they. I don't like their offense. Who the Pacers? Yeah, they 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 a fast paced team. Like who who they play? They oh, play. Yeah. Yeah, they definitely. They play is. the Knicks. Ooh, yeah, the Knicks would be tough for them to beat. But I think they can get the Knicks. Yeah, and then they would end up playing. I'm going with the Mavericks. Probably the Cavaliers. Yeah, I, th- I think I think they can go. I think they can go. I think Luca all he gotta do is get hot this oh, playoffs yeah. and he can win a one. They definitely been looking like the best team over the last couple of weeks. So yeah, yeah, him and Kyrie just clip with each other, make mm-hmm. sure they play both yeah, of them. Yeah, and, and that's that's a huge thing. Like both of them been putting up a lot of points. Yeah. Like being able to run the offense, you got you can run that offense with two different two different people. Like that's what you need. Goddamn, missing this man. He taking a shit, y'all. <laughs> Here he got uh he got uh IBS. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> swear. Yeah, I, I, I heard uh they started stinking around here a second ago. <laughs> 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 I heard uh Draymond Gray was saying that you know you know Brandon Podolinski or whatever his name is for the Warriors. Yeah. Uh, Draymond Green was trying to say that he deserves Rookie of the Year because he got the best plus minus of anybody uh, or any rookie. I'm like, uh, bro, like, stupid. just because you got the best plus minus, <laughs> no, like, you on, he on the Warriors. If he don't got the best plus minus of any rookie, then, like, he, he ain't doing his job out there. But but, shout but to, out to, to win it over Wimby, like, no. But shout out to him putting his own teammate on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, of course you're going to say your own teammate, but, like, his, his reasoning was just, like, the plus minus. I was just like, bro, 
Like he he played like with, with the Warriors. Said on his podcast. Uh, nah, he said it uh, in an interview like earlier in the week, oh. like after a game. Draymond? Yeah, Draymond was talking about uh, Brandon Podolski should win Rookie of the Year because he got the best plus minus of all the rookies. I don't know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> now we do exactly because Draymond shouted him out. Now we'll be looking for him. Somebody pull. Somebody laughing now. They 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 put uh they they did put him in the start lineup over Clay Thompson for a short time, but now now he's coming off the bench again. So, well, that's but, just that's but, just because the fans were telling it, everybody to sit Clay down. Well, it's gonna be good though. So, somebody should slap that man, cause, like for him to think that anybody should win it over Wimby other than Chet. Like <laughs> Wimby been doing things that ain't been done in, in decades. Chet not a rookie. Y'all y'all seen Wimby's new logo? For his Nike or his Nike logo, uh, it's it like, yeah, yeah, it's fine. It's basically like an alien that looks like a basketball. <laughs> <laughs> that what he looked like too. They hit on the spot. I fuck with it. Yeah, I fuck with it. Yeah, that might be one of their best logos they did in a while. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a fine logo. I thought they usually well, they, yeah, that's fine. You know, usually they try to make out a logo. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how they did Kawhi's. He fought legally over with Nike with the cloth. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That was real probably. I wanted to see that. Oh, he wanted an ownership of it? That logo I could definitely see on the side of a shoe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a black shoe with a silver logo. You know, they probably have the best shoes for him now. What shoe he got out? He got a shoe out? I'm just saying, when they drop a shoe, like they probably have some of the best shoes. You know that bit about to sell. Oh, yeah. That's a five logo, like. I already know I ain't going to be able to get it. Song of a shoe anything. Mm-hmm. I got to get me a pair of his. I got the Wendy's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hopefully they clean. He definitely about to change the league, boy. Who's sound with Nike? Yeah. Nike. Well, of course uh, Nike. <laughs> <laughs> I see all the chicks. I thought it was, thought it was like a Nike or Jordan collab or something like that. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, that's rare right there, man. Yeah, George Jordan would have been smart to nab that nigga, though. <laughs> <laughs> it's smart to draft him. I know they're seeing the shoes on sale. Yeah, basketball players are seeing the shoes on sale. What, Jordan's? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one, I remember who everybody was going crazy with the mellow. No way back in the day. But them team Jordans, ain't they? Uh, Chris Paul was too focused on it. And they were just on the basketball level, not like a legion wearing out. Yeah, I never. Yeah, I don't. I think only one person should be on uh Jordan brand, and that's Jordan. Yeah, I agree. Like, I, at this point, like you just confuse me if you got a Jordan logo with another nigga. I got the mellow. See, that's DeAndre Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> Kobe will win Nike. You see that one? I yeah, I like. I like how Nike do shit. And there ain't oh, no yeah, they... face on Nike, yeah. so. Anybody could be on that motherfucker. As long as you got his logo in, you might have his signature on the side of you. It'd be crazy they did uh, Wimby with the uh, Jordan logo. They just put that alien head on top of the Jordan logo. <laughs> That'd be fine, though. That'd be fine. <laughs> that I'm would be fine. I'm with it. They'd be like, I'm fake Jordan. <laughs> These are Wimby's. Air Wimby. For real. <laughs> That'd be lit. That'd be lit. He do look like an alien. <laughs> Yo, know, he's just so bad, Slender Man for Halloween. This y'all so funny, did you see? Nice. Hell yeah. Man, y'all like, this man looks like Slender Man. That's a laughing. I don't want to see you walking behind me. This nigga tall as hell. In a suit, too. That was really creepy, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I did see that. I did see that. <laughs> yeah, that, that man wild with that. <laughs> <laughs> man, look like he get ready to rob somebody. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, Wimby hell. Yeah, they never know it was me. <laughs> yeah, it was like some seven foot dude. <laughs> That'd be a dead giveaway right there. You could have just been her brother. Yeah, that man look. <laughs> that man crazy for that one. <laughs> that look crazy. Like they got one of his stockings. Yeah, I'm under here. <laughs> That's crazy, man. Yeah, man. But yeah, yeah. Time, time, is he gonna compete with LeBron records? What? 
how many points he averaged in this year. He ain't averaging twenty. Yeah, no I think way. I, oh, God. I don't know. I, if I if I had to guess, but he I say like twenty two. I think like 18. Yeah, it gotta be. I don't feel like he hit twenty like that. When he does get up there, he get up there. Yeah, he. I mean, he had a few thirty point games, yeah, so yeah. that's the only reason why I'm like, yeah, it gotta be like twenty two at least. Hopefully, he got. That man should be at the top. Okay. <laughs> oh, man, don't see it. 21. Yeah, you see that? Okay, okay. I said 22. So he, so he should. Uh, it's 20. And it's it's, it's 21.4, so I, I was real close. So give me that point .4. He could, he could do LeBron numbers. Oh, yeah, he could. He, yeah, he could. Let me, let me compare his stats to LeBron's stats. A rookie year, LeBron was 20. 20. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they pay you. But he yeah, wasn't he averaging get, a double he's double. Get the pieces around him. LeBron probably was like seven rebounds. I mean, I bet, I'm pretty sure he probably like averaging like six blocks a game. I mean, shooting forty six percent, at least four, at least four, six is high. <laughs> yeah, three point eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Six is a motherfucker. <laughs> I'm telling you, yeah, or nothing. <laughs> Like you should make a bad decision yeah, if he gets six blocks. One, point, one game, he had like eight. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I, I yeah, expect yeah. games for him to go crazy. But every game, that nigga got to be nine foot. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, the Spurs definitely got, got their future with him. It was great. It was, I know they happy. Mm-hmm. He played. He played. So, other they, than they, him, Spurs what? ended up beating the Nuggets last night. Other than him, what other team got they stars? I mean, there are a few is. I ain't saying that's not. Like but. for the future? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and? Yeah. Feel like we do this every but, week. But, but. I, but I, don't, I don't know what it is about Ant. Like, I, I, I just feel like something going to happen to him to where, like, he, he don't have as long of a career, huh? He reckless with that body. Yeah, yeah. I see a Roy. lot of cases of that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I ain't gonna say oh yeah, but but Gian, Giannis is injured right now. He ended up hurting his calf or something like that when they ended up beating the Celtics earlier in the week. Which I mean that that was good for him to be able to get one game against the Celtics, just prepare for the playoffs. But I just I don't see the Bucks being able to beat them on the road. They've been playing horribly on the road. I just had this man thirty three million dollars. <laughs> Aaron, uh, Gordon Hayward. <laughs> that's what, that's why I was, somebody else must have paid him, and he just ended up going there. Yeah, and they paid him less. Yeah, yeah, that's probably. Crazy. I felt like he been over there a while too. Nah, he just got oh, over yeah. there this year. He oh, was on. Yeah. He, he, I think he was, he was in Charlotte a I years think. ago. I was he was on. He was five. Right? I ain't gonna lie to you. He got hurt years ago. Gordon Hayward. I think it was Jazz. Yeah. yeah. Same way with that. Who that other guy who was on the Rockets who was real five? Lakers. Up being injured. Uh, P.J. Tucker. Man, you man swear P.J. Tucker. <laughs> <laughs> he barely uh, getting minutes now. Chandler Parsons. Oh. Mm-hmm. He was fine. He gave him that deal and he was trash. I'm telling you. He, was, <laughs> he got hurt though, didn't he? I think so, yeah. but it was still like. I think he ended up in Memphis after that. He was at it before that. He don't get no white boy that deal. I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> Unless it's a joke. 31.5. So yeah, yeah, he was he was a good player back in the day. Him and uh, the Marcus Favors got got a three way tie for the number one seed in the West. Who you think ends up winning it? The uh, Thunder, the Timberwolves, or the Nuggets? Nuggets. Yeah, Nuggets. That. <laughs> they, I know the three way title. Yeah, but the the Nuggets basically need both the other teams to lose. So that that's what's going to be tough for them to be able to get that number one seed. Like, even if they win that game, they still need the other two to lose to be able to get the number one seed. You just hit the schedule. Hey, regardless, I, I believe in Nugs. I'll go out there and shake up the league. We need tomorrow. a dynasty. You said the last game on. Yeah, tomorrow. I wonder why they skipped the day. Oh, yeah, I don't know what. Uh, I guess they just, like, left today for uh, UFC and baseball or something. I don't know. But they ain't playing a single Where's game today. Now we ain't worried about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm to see the 
So yeah, um, I don't even know. Oh yeah, see, the Nuggets will definitely win against the Grizzlies. Uh, Suns son, son have something to play for, so Timberwolves could end up losing that game, but the the, the Suns was down. <laughs> they were down by like 25 points in the first quarter of a, a game against the uh, Clippers earlier this week. I don't think, I don't think the like, even the both, the both, both uh, Devin Booker and Kevin Durant were 0 for 5, like to start off the game. I just, I was just, in, I looked in, I was like, man, like what, what's going on in this game? Uh, and when I ended up looking, the Suns were they had five points, and the Clippers had like twenty seven. Uh, in in the first quarter, bro, <laughs> in the first quarter, I was like, bro, that like that that's horrible. That is so horrible. So that's why like I don't have too much faith in, in the Suns. But then the Thunder playing the Mavericks, that's gonna be a tough one. So yeah, yeah, the Nuggets could end up getting it. Yeah, I, I thought he was saying the Lakers jump Suns. They're behind. Nah, nah, yeah, the Suns, the Suns are locked in, but but they're going like the Suns and the Lakers are going to play for the seventh seed, like as far as the playing goes. And I know the Lakers beat the Suns in the uh, in season tournament. Uh, I don't want to so, go with Durant, but I'm mad. Every time Durant and LeBron play, LeBron's the best. One. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm, I'm tired of seeing them even back when it was in OKC. Man. I I, 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 def I definitely feel like the Lakers. I think I, if, if I had, if I had to guess who ends up winning the playing games. For the West, I would say it's the Lakers and the uh, Warriors, Kevin Durant. And, yeah, and, and, the, and the Suns don't make it, and the Kings don't make it. Yeah. The only Lakers getting that, he ain't swatted down by the Lakers, man. I just want the Mavericks to win. You would be want nice Luka to get that ring? Yeah, yeah, I definitely think he'll get one. Oh yeah, 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 he'll be. I, I, it's, <laughs> it's going, it's going to be tough, but he of could course, end up being like course. Dirk. Just end up going their whole career, balling out and everything, and then he just had that one special year. Yeah. I want to go out there as long as you lead your team. Like, it did seem like a, a dirk player. Oh, yeah, I think, I, think, I think he's a Maverick for life. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think be. Mark Cuban would – Mark Cuban gave up a lot to get him, to just to get him there. Give like, him I half of the team. Keep him there. Like, if, if he was able to keep Dirk there and keep Dirk happy, he'll, he'll be able to keep Dodgers yeah, I think the foreign players are more loyal to teams than yeah. the fucking people here. So, let's we'll see how that goes. Anything crazy in goddamn football? The draft coming up, I doubt. There ain't nothing really changed in that. All the mock drafts are pretty much the same. Everybody just waiting for the down trades to happen. Got, 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 a, got a shout out, Logan Ryan. Pre appreciate your help this season, my boy. Enjoy your retirement. Oh, he retired? Yeah, he retired. Sad you couldn't get in the ring, man. He, he's got enough of them, though, so we ain't going to talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, man. We, we, try to, we, we try to send you off well, but, you know, yeah, injuries. Yeah, no, how he said we. He, he part of the squad now. Nah, he's part of that. <laughs> you know, it's his retirement. I'm trying to make him feel good. Like, damn, I ain't trying to shit on him, man. I just said that. Y'all couldn't, couldn't do what y'all said y'all were going to do at the beginning of the season for him. Yeah, you, you and me both. You and me both. I mean, he, he wasn't on the team until, like, halfway through the season. Like, yeah, I, think he got, he came, I think he came around, like, Thanksgiving or so, whenever we lost Ufunga. Yeah, he got on the team because he thought y'all had it. I ain't had the juice, man. This upcoming year, though. But as they say, who got the juice now? <laughs> Shit, no I hope it's us. Uh, uh, the I Chiefs. Proud, <laughs> and speaking on the Chiefs, I would. I miss it. Losing one of my papers, so can't even start the intro of my shit. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. My Rashi. Oh yeah. Really need to talk about OJ, but oh yeah, I ain't yeah. gonna I ain't gonna go in on OJ. RP to you, man. Man, the, I, I would I, think I would think about it earlier in, in the week. Well, actually, I was thinking about it more today. But like after I ended up hearing it, it'd be it'd be so crazy if that like I don't know if he did it or not, but. It, like if he didn't he did do it, it, like for everybody, like every time they see you, be like murderer. <laughs> like that, that, that job would be crazy, bro. I mean, like, I don't know the man how wrote a book too. That. Like that's yeah, like, my whole thing. It. Yeah, if he if he actually did it, but like, but my whole thing too I is like, he did how, it. like if if you got folks like constantly like coming up to you, being like, oh, you did it and all that stuff. Like, why wouldn't you spend like most of your like most of your resources and most of your life like trying to figure out like what happened and who did it, that's who like saying. sued your name and everything. I like it, like man. I mean, he, even though he lost that case, his life was over after that case. 
Yeah, he, he yeah. Can't no regular job. He can't like. He can't do nothing for regular. I mean, he he ended up having to pay the uh, the girl's family like for like uh, a wrongful death suit, like thirty three million or something like that. You might, but, but they end up. But yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, but, like the only thing you got out of that was just staying out of jail. But he put all that mainly came off of the book because he ended up couldn't pay all of the shit because he was broke or something, and yeah. he ended up writing a book. But the judge gave the book to the family, and the family put it out. Oh, wow. And the book is literally how I got away with murder or some shit like that, what the book called. And he yeah. basically describes what happened, but saying, like, this would happen if I would have did it. Yeah, that's wild. Yeah, the whole book out with that shit. Yeah, freedom of speech, man. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, right, wrong, and, and double jeopardy too. Yeah, yeah. I'm about, about to say double jeopardy. You know, like after, oh, after he, yeah, after he was acquitted. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they, yeah. They ain't shit again. you can do. Like that's the only thing I don't like about everything. I feel like he did it, but also at the same time, court said fuck it, he's free. Yeah. We should have dropped it after that, pretty yeah. much. Because if the court, you know, hey, everybody like, else about the government all the other times. But literally, like all them shows, like comedians made him the butt of jokes and stuff like that, mm-hmm. like. That that if if he didn't do it, then like that that's as a horrible way to like live live out the rest of your life. Oh, well, I ain't, like that, what you're known for. I ain't gonna say he. I ain't gonna even act like he didn't do it. I I don't know. That's something yeah. I can damn guarantee. But all the information, I I will. They came to me talking about we would tell you right now, but you have put your house up. I was like, yeah, he did it, and then they would tell me. I would assume they would tell me and say, he, oh, he didn't do it or whatever. But I would put my money up and say he did it. Because that shit don't make no sense. And if he didn't, how the hell you ain't even... Why nobody even trying to find this man that murdered two folks? Yeah. <laughs> like, what? Like, that, that, that's, that's what was crazy about. Like, basically, like, everybody thinking, like, oh, yeah, he did it. But then he still ended up, like, not being accused. Like, I, I don't know how he did that. <laughs> I don't know how he did that. You know, they you writing a book. Like, you must really hate your wife. <laughs> You know, really no, he was broke like and trying to make money. Really to it, like, he he you was know, broke. He some type of exactly. He wrote the book, which I didn't read the book, so I don't know all what was in it and all that shit. But at the same time, what I the reviews of the book and what other people had said about the book is just there's nothing positive or nothing like. Basically, he just pretty much in the book say how he got away with murder. Yeah, that, I heard a reporter talking about when I ended up hearing about it. She was like, yeah, that was a, a big time in America uh, for black folks because it showed them that they could beat the system. I was like, I don't want to beat the system like that. <laughs> <laughs> you beat yeah. the system when you know you're innocent. You ain't no <laughs> yeah, exactly. And, and a whole other thing, and don't get me wrong, white folks do black folks wrong too, but it's just like uh, after he death, all these black folks was like, ah, oh, let them rest in peace and all that type of stuff and all that. I'm like, honestly, I feel like he did it. So I feel like I should be able to say whatever the hell I want about this man. I don't think he was a good person in that at all. But at the same time, it don't change. That man was a former MVP, rushed for over 13,000 yards and all that type of shit. He was a stud on the football field for sure. Yeah. What, six-time pro bowler? Well, what if, what if they opened him up and said, like, oh, yeah, he had CTE or something like that, and that would end up making him, like... Oh, I, I would definitely I would definitely put that in accountability because I feel like, like, of course, he did it to himself because nobody just, just forced him to Just a bad judgment day. Yeah. yeah. I think it was something crazy, like... Yeah, it, it possibly, it possibly could, because, like, I don't know, I had this man, like, seven games he rushed for 1,500 yards. It was something crazy like that. Yeah. Like, I had had seven games he rushed for 1,500 yards. Mm-hmm. Oh, and, and, and 14 games, it was 2,000 yards. You know what I'm saying? Like, that, that's crazy. And that's yeah. the best single season rushing ever because how less games he did it. 2,000, two I think. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know you couldn't fear no folks. How you oh, yeah, like, yeah. you trucking folks, bro. Like, mm-hmm. yeah, it possibly could have. I mean, it possibly all. No, my yeah, motherfuckers have it. Because you got to think at that point, he probably, I, 15 years in playing football, not even professionally, just playing it. You gotta think, then back in the day, they ain't have him like we got now. Like, hey. Yeah, dog, and the one little bar over your yeah. face, too. <laughs> Jim Brown, Brown had the bad. Jimmy Brace from Ed, Ed, and Eddie over there. <laughs> 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 so, yeah, man, I don't, I don't, it is what it is. I don't think he was a good person. He's going about your day, my boy. That's how I see it. Uh, so, like, I don't think so. Only God can judge my kicker. 
Oh, definitely, Nobody definitely. Never know. Yeah, that it, it would it would have been crazy. Like on his deathbed, he he would just like, I'm purify my soul. I'm gonna come clean. Oh, <laughs> he was just like, yeah, I did it. That's yeah, what everybody yeah, was, was hoping. Sure. If he knew he was about to die, he probably. I ain't gonna say he would, cause I don't know him, but he died on like on yeah. the table. But, like, if he probably knew he was gonna die, he probably. He, it's my, my, yeah, yeah, my whole thing is if, if he did do it, I wonder if there's anybody that he, like, confessed to, like, throughout his life. Like, just be like, yeah, like, I ended up doing this. I regret it or something along those lines. I feel like he had to. That's a lot to keep in. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's a terrible person. like you, got, you got kids and stuff like that. Like, they know. I'm, I feel like you would have said, like, if they asked you, like, hey, did you do this? But then like, again, you just he could just like that shit out. And, like, he probably... He, also, he could possibly just think in his own head that he really didn't do it. Yeah, he yeah. could. Like, Dude, over time, you could definitely convince yourself hell to yeah. jump, like, into Mind false realities. The human brain is crazy now. Like, like this didn't really happen. I'm not really OJ. Yeah. <laughs> well, he, went so black, he was OJ. So, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, when you know. dead, you were black then. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you had the in there, yeah. But yeah, it was, it was a wild week in football. A lot of weird shit. Terrell Slugs got locked up. Terrell Suggs did? I mean, he got out, but yeah. He but ended yeah, up, that, that's well. He ended up getting an altercation at Starbucks and uh, mm-hmm. pulled his gun out. <laughs> <laughs> that, as big as that I man ain't, ain't, he don't need to pull I ain't, no I ain't got my paper for it, so I ain't going to go crazy. Huh? Some of the gun or the gun? Like, I'm trying to see you no, no, his gun. gun. I'm going to flex on you. I'm going to pull it like beat somebody else. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, he ended up backing into somebody's shit, and uh, the person pretty much started arguing with him and all that shit, because you backed in my shit. Yeah. And uh, he ended up, like, uh, es- making that escalate by pulling out a gun and threatening the man's life. And then when he did that, he drove off, but the people followed him. They said there was, like, two cars that followed him all the way to his house. Oh, no. And then uh, when the cops got, because uh, they were talking to the cops on the way to the house, so, like, they didn't. Terrell says that uh, he showed the gun on his property because he was threatening that he was being followed and all that shit. And everybody, all everybody at Starbucks said, "Nah, he showed that bitch in the parking lot." <laughs> and they followed him and all that. And he was like uh, uh, six three, two hundred sixty pounds. Talking about he was scared of the person, and they didn't describe the man. They just said the man was under six foot. Yeah, <laughs> come on now. That yeah. that, that one, when you say he pulled a gun, I'm like that man too big to be pulling that a gun what I'm on saying? anybody. His charges is like uh. Dis- disorderly conduct with a weapon and intimidate and I like if anything he definitely getting an intimidation charge <laughs> <I'm telling you. laughs> like he look intimidated as fuck <laughs> you gonna walk up on somebody you catch that charge you know what I'm saying ain't no judge gonna be like you was fearful of your life you look at that dude like yeah. you know what I'm saying I'm like this motherfucker had to have a clown car and the clown with a car with a pack full of clowns <laughs> <laughs> the only way I'm hearing this shit ain't no way man man that man, that man said, any given Sunday, anything can happen. <laughs> you don't know what somebody can do to you. <laughs> man, fuck all that. So, yeah, I think that was pretty stupid of him. Just just claim that w- what you did, what you did. You got money. You ain't like shit really going to happen to you. Yeah. You already did your 17 years in the NFL. Yeah. If OJ got off, he can get off. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> shit, that's not even the worst shit. Rasheen Rice shit is, oh, yeah, in yeah, my right eyes, way worse. Yeah, that Rashi Rice stuff is crazy. Because, you know, uh, fucking uh, Missouri governor just um, commuted goddamn Britt Reed, Andy Reed's son, off of the basically the same charges. Yeah. So, and that motherfucker injured a five-year-old child. Yeah. So, like, if anything, I really feel like Britt's... Should still be in jail, and Rasheen Rice. I mean, whatever should happen should happen. Same shit. If West Chicago get locked up, he should only do like two months in jail and get him on out and go on about it. Cause like I don't understand just cause you a governor and this motherfucker is a, who the fuck no Brit Reed. I'm telling. But, I mean, I understand this is why it's getting under the radar and all this shit. But I don't, I don't, I don't like that shit at all. Yeah. I started reading too. I, I was reading too much in that shit. Just getting mad. It's just like this man white. They won the Super Bowl. His son, get, uh, I'm talking about drinking at the Kansas City facility and drove away. It ain't like he was at Rick. his home or anything, huh? Rick. Yeah, that, that yeah. was like two years ago or so. I ain't know nothing about it. Either, yeah. I, think, I think it was the year they played the uh, Buccaneers in the Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah but, but but I think it was like a year of him waiting for trial and all that shit. Yeah, and then when yeah. he went to jail, they saying he ain't even been in there that long. And they commuted his shit already. That so, will happen when you got money. Yeah, and win a Super Bowl. Yeah, and yeah, dad, dad's a head coach 
of your favorite football team. Like they, they were saying, Patrick Mahomes' dad's supposed to get like ten years or so. I bet, I bet you he don't do more than two. Ten years. What he done did? Huh? What he did? DWI. You see John everybody. Talks, everybody. Man. Yeah, he, he got to stay to him, man. That's a, that's a that's a real black dude, man. <laughs> 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 he smoking black and white cigars and all that. So yeah, like, I'm pretty. Yeah, I, I ain't surprised he got hit with DUI. I, I, I remember ahead of time I seen him recording. He be looking geeked all the time. Yeah. <laughs> I'm high as hell right yeah, now. Yeah, so like, My son probably be bringing me a pound later. <laughs> I ain't surprised. <laughs> My son's one of the greatest of all time. I deserve this. <laughs> for real, for right. real. If it wasn't for my sperm, y'all wouldn't be watching yeah, good I'll football. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I would be doing stuff legally, but I would be over the limit legally, though. Like, yeah, I don't know how that makes sense, but like, yo, that's how I be. How, how he is, I'll be getting the same type of charge. Like, he ain't doing nothing crazy. Mm. Like he ain't doing, but like my my whole thing, like the only reason why he probably he facing ten years because he been caught before. before. Like yeah. if if I'm caught once, I mean I shouldn't be the one saying that. But if if I get caught once, like drinking and driving, like I make sure like you as much money as Patrick Mahomes make, man, t- take a Uber or a Lyft, <laughs> bro. Like come on, I don't understand that at all. You Patrick Mahomes, especially in Kansas City. Yeah, you Patrick Mahomes, like you I'm gonna give you a ride for free. Exactly. You talking to you about your son the whole time till you get done. I know that man. Yeah, yeah I birthed him. Yeah, I know that. Yeah, like that's the whole time. I remember when he sucked that football. Uh, <laughs> I can Facetime with him right now. <laughs> and he gonna pick up. Uh, <laughs> uh, can I take a picture with you, man? You just in the back of the uh, seat. Uh, <laughs> hey, 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 yeah, yeah. Can you believe I just Uber past my home's dad? Like, mm-hmm. Yeah, they, they, they ain't no, there ain't no reason why he should be getting a DWI. But that flip on um, Patrick to be able to still be seen so clean in front of the mainstream, cause everybody love Patrick. Nobody see him doing nothing wrong. Yeah. But good, then you got his brother, his dad, his wife, his wife. Yeah. like everybody else doing whatever the hell they mm-hmm. want to. I said like his brother, I mean him and his mama. I don't think he. I don't even see here nothing about his mom. I don't know what she. Yeah. Is. I guess she stayed. She, she stayed where she supposed to be. At. <laughs> Probably mm-hmm. somewhere getting donkey fucked. His brother. I don't even remember, remember his brother's name. Is it Bryce? Jace. Jason. I don't know. I, after he danced on Sean Taylor shit, I didn't give a fuck about the dude. Yeah, the dude kissed his lady. <laughs> Drunk as hell. I can't believe he did it, man. Uh, I, think, I think they said uh, his parents named him Patrick and his brother Spongebob. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, he's yeah, a complete idiot. I don't fuck with him at all. <laughs> Anybody dance on Sean Taylor shit I ain't fucking with. Shout out to the sister, though. <laughs> yeah, everybody love Joy. <laughs> joy, joy. Joy is my joy. <laughs> Even though I don't watch it like that. Yeah, yeah, I don't watch it like that either anymore. It'd be really bad, I know. But I still. I <laughs> <laughs> swear. You know who Joy Taylor is, don't you? Uh, she, she used to be on, like, uh, the herd with Cal- Colin Cowherd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah the little now, now she'd be with, uh, who's that, Acho and LaShawn McCoy. I know who you're talking about, bro. Oh, yeah. no, 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 that ain't no. I thought you sounded like white no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's Sean's sister. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, she grew up. She like, uh, I have seen her. <laughs> you, yeah, if you yeah, watch she, sports, she you have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, thinking, I'm thinking of uh, Molly. She, she, she was Molly, Molly before Molly. Molly yeah. Be it's like Molly can be her mama or something. <laughs> she, yeah. Get up out here. I'm about to say, you can keep going through some more pictures. <laughs> <laughs> I'm perfectly fine in this show doing that. I got to show these. We can show y'all, we will. But y'all we, will we will, we will, we uh, will. I'll put some yeah, pictures up her. You uh, showed a good picture of Steam. <laughs> 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 I seen, I seen. That was a good picture of her. <laughs> yeah, he didn't want to show the picture I saw. <laughs> I'm telling you that, that, that was like, I meant to say something to him about it. Man. I, I want to watch it. I just like, man, this man felt the like, best picture he possibly could. Like, this, this girl don't never look like this. He's like, yeah, this why I like her. I was like, man, what the hell are you talking about? What the hell? What the hell? He 
<laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> they be like, oh, this boy got horrible taste. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know, man, if he hit him. Right? <laughs> <laughs> they say he want the city women. <laughs> 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 don't get stink faces so far, man. Ooh, I ain't got much to say about that. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I, I'm trying to get my head in and better. I'm gonna have some shit. I'm, I'm trying to put the schedule up while we talk about it and shit like that, so they can see interact with the fans. You know. Okay, okay. I see you. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Yeah, uh, dog. You, you gonna you gonna try to get our roller coaster fans uh <laughs> listening to the podcast again? <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Did I, did I seen that on the last time. I don't know if I sent. I sent it to them this week. <laughs> I ain't trying to get banned in the roller coaster. You know, yeah. I'll be on Reddit posting the shit, and then I got in trouble. Like, I ain't gonna get in trouble, but I woke up one day with like 30 messages off of goddamn Reddit. I go through Reddit. You're like, my, our stuff popping. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, uh, I went on Reddit. It was just everybody roasted me, bro. I'm oh, yeah. talking about roasted me, man. What's the video? I put it in the wrong subreddit. Like, it's a, it's a subreddit about roller coasters, and then, like, you go through it, just. Oh, y'all need to try to go to this place, uh, Twin Peaks, not Twin Peaks, another place, <laughs> and, and try this roller coaster and another one. Oh, try Six Flags next roller coaster, and then I keep on scrolling. You got come check out my podcast. <laughs> 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 Everything about roller coaster, I just got a podcast out of nowhere on that motherfucker. They gave so me yeah, yeah, they gave me hell. I'm talking about nobody like the. My post, but in the comments, motherfucker got like 50 likes and shit like that. Oh my god! Yeah, just, just destroying me. Like, we, like, we don't, we don't like what you said. We like what everybody else saying. Yeah, they was like, they was like, uh, which one of y'all like is the no launch queen? And I said the one in the middle, cause you was the one in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> it's something with roller coasters, bro. I don't know. They wrote back. I can see it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You want me to show you how I'm dead? <laughs> no, no, I'm saying. I'm gonna start doing like that. <laughs> it's something about roller coasters, man. You. <laughs> If I look up no lunch queen, it's on gate. I'm gonna tell you. That's all I'm telling you. I hope it's nothing gay. <laughs> no, no lunch queen is just like <laughs> the queen ain't got nothing to do with. <laughs> they like a no lunch roller coaster or something. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's something like where they don't launch you out like roller coaster wise or something. It's it's, it's a roller coaster goddamn subreddit. They gonna have lingo that we ain't gonna understand for sure. <laughs> there you see, there ain't nothing. No larger <laughs> Got your shirt. <laughs> It was just a joke. I, I was trying to get that, man. They were flaming me in there, bro. <laughs> yeah, I had to say something. I had to say something. I had to say something. I'm telling you. Know, you. Like, I'm telling you. Like, I'm telling you. Like, oh, man, I, I messed up. Time, time to make somebody else pay for it. <laughs> 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 Who threw the baseball off the window? <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. So I do that again for us. <laughs> they give me a t-shirt with her on it. There's still a lot of interactions with it. I don't want to delete it. That thing know I'm be on YouTube. Dude got roasted. Seriously roasted. <laughs> Up to a crisp. <laughs> You don't be mad, you like, you, but I lit me, or I ain't even know nothing about it till now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've been doing about it for like two weeks. Yeah, it's been about two weeks, bro. It's been a long time. You don't know what's going on, do you? That about to be your dick day hard this year. Yeah, man. NLQ. Where's Lawrence? Where's no Lawrence at? I forgot my Mac truck. Yeah, yeah, nah. Yeah, man. That's hilarious. Max over here for real. That's hilarious. <laughs> but it's crazy.
crazy out of all my shit on Reddit, that's the only one that did anything. I mean, of course, there's some few likes. Man, I was pissed because uh, I ended up talking to the administrator of the 85, uh, 85 South show. And I ended up getting my shit posted on there with like 600,000 followers on that motherfucker. And I'm like, oh, yeah, this is about to take off. Three, three likes. <laughs> I was like, well, I'm going to try again next week. Yeah. Yeah, she was like, yeah, just hit me up and do all that. So, yeah. Five, five, it'll, take, it'll take some time, but we going to get there. We're going to yeah. get there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We need to get we, A5 South Show in Atlanta. We need to get on there. If it's in Atlanta. <sighs> uh, our jokes got to be hella up then. I'm telling you. Uh, I ain't talking about just jokes. So I, we could just have jokes on the flame and motherfuckers. You know, we going to have to get on DC oh, yeah, ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like Lopes too much to start talking about him. I just need to chill, guy. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Like that one on the podcast, like where you take it to class when them niggas sit in like a desk and the dude at the front and they just start roasting each other the whole shit. That shit pretty funny. That's where I found Cam, Cam Cabot or whatever his name is. But yeah, 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 yeah. That'd be lit to do. If we get big enough, we'll have a, uh, have a roast. Somebody, somebody be on the bidet and then we get a whole bunch of people with roast and shit. And we got upcoming plans. We're going to have some uh, uh, gas sooner or later. You know, Cam want to come through, do his thing. He, he said on episode 10, but we'll see. He want to come drop a freestyle and shit. And he, I told him. He, he want to make sure we cement it in this before he <laughs> <up>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, he talking about he going to drop a song when he, uh, well, I think the song going to already be out when he comes on here, but it's going to be okay. around the same time. And I like oh, if you if you think we can take you out of there, we will try. <laughs> yeah, I, I was listening to a song that I did back in the day this morning. I was like, man, I can't believe I thought this jump was good. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be like that. No, no, man. You're too for now. We might look at our first one like, I can't believe we saw oh, it. Oh, yeah, I already know. <laughs> we, we I, I look is. back on it now and be like that. <laughs> 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 a week that's what we do it uh, all together okay, probably five thousand you're gonna look at this the year two and all bro like we came a long way man yeah hopefully have a patreon and all that with it yeah i think i think oh yeah 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 i think things will get a lot easier like especially once football starts back up yeah, again and oh, yeah, 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 yeah. we just get the that get a, a cult following and be able to start i ain't even trying to say sell shit but they do exclusive shit where they can go get it and shit on patreon and shit like that just be like Lipton tea. <laughs> <laughs> shit. <laughs> anybody, man, that one, it's boy, awesome, you can't man. tell me if we don't get up to like 50,000 viewers at some point. Somebody gonna reach out for us, they don't sponsor or something. <laughs> like something like Vernon, boy. Mm-hmm. Unity, like Lipton. <laughs> no, I'll take anything, boy. Like, Lipton tea for them thirsty folks out there. <laughs> 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 well, I killed that in 30 minutes, bro. <laughs> 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 Make you want to pee while we're doing our show. Yeah, well, he definitely ain't going to like the jokes that was said when he was gold, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was all shit. <laughs> I kept my mouth shut. I'm over here trying to bring it back to sports and stuff. That's why when you came in, we were talking about Draymond. Come on, come on. We were talking about some IBS and stuff. <laughs> Somebody was saying about him, he'd be clipping it. <laughs> no, no, I will. I let it ride, man. Nah. Say if it's somebody to say somebody stay, just go like Sting when he put up. <laughs> totally opposite. You know? Hey, I'm, I'm just, she, she, I, I gave her the little Sting flavor where you can still see what you're talking about. Man, you gave her a stinger. <laughs> <laughs> nah, she already got that. Her mother gave her that one. <laughs> so yeah, 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 man. It was just lighthearted jokes, man. Alright, that was. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. You watch over and let me know if you like it or not, and I'll take it out. I won't make it a TikTok clip. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was pretty good, though. I thought it was pretty good. I know about yourself next time. I'll say about you when you Oh, uh, oh. See, see, they said I ain't never getting up to go to the bathroom again. <laughs> 
yeah, yeah, yeah. Usually how we close the show is somebody shit start up, cutting off, but everybody fully charged this week, so. That's why we just been going for talking about nothing for the last 20 minutes. <laughs> So yeah, it is anything. They ain't the UFC. There ain't no big old fights on anybody. I want to see. How how how'd you feel about Cody Rhodes winning? I didn't like it, but yeah. I understand it. But I didn't like you, you, it. You think they? Do you think Roman about to like basically do what Rock and Cena ended up doing? Uh, yeah, like I don't, transitioning out. Uh, nah, I think Roman be back, but I don't think he coming back until probably a month before SummerSlam or something. He definitely yeah. gone for a while, but you know they brought another family member yesterday to join the crew. Mm. Yeah, they end up kicking up out the other Uso brother and brought another family member in last night. So, yeah, I don't know what's gonna happen to the Usos now. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's uh, another episode of Any Given Sunday where we do it on Saturdays. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, episode four on the way. Out of the way now. Yeah, yeah, out of <laughs> yeah. the way. Episode five coming soon. As we, soon as next week. <laughs> <laughs> they be coming by quick though. Oh yeah. Like, out of nowhere, I be like, damn, I gotta come do this. That's why I ain't bring nothing up until like nine o'clock last night. I was not even on my mind. Yeah, I was hoping that we <laughs> nobody would mention it. We do it later in the day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I get to sleep in. Hey, hey, if y'all want to do it later, nah, I mean, nah, we I'm, straight, we straight, let's get it out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, 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 I see CJ trying to keep on about to click, click out of his recording. So, yeah, any given Sunday episode four, we be back next week. Hopefully, CJ ain't mad at me about the jokes, but yeah. Hopefully. Appreciate y'all rocking with us. Yeah, bet, bet, bet. We keep the mic hot. Catch anything off air. Do 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 do. even bad. I wasn't making no jokes. <laughs> I know that.